Hey everyone, welcome back to the Mojito channel. I'm your host, Chad Mojito, and today, riddle me this. Why is it that despite the fact that I have about 300 unplayed games in my Steam library, games that are begging to be discovered, to be explored, to be enjoyed, all I want to do right now is install Half-Life 2 again. I know that it's in part because of how I am. Routine and ordinary familiar experiences always feel really comforting to me. And on the other hand, new experiences, new things always seem boring and not worth it. And I, I always think I'm, I, it's going to be not worth the, uh, the hassle, you know? And also, in the past I've been disappointed a lot by video games, that's a fair point, but also I've had a lot of good surprises. Lots of games that I didn't think much of turned out to be great fun and experiences that I greatly enjoyed. Thanks a lot to Steam Sales and Humble Bundles, lots of those games I've paid only one or two bucks for. And I've got relatively new and exciting stuff like, like Dark Souls 3, Rise of the, of the Tomb Raider, Mad Max, and also I've got a, a bunch of indie games games that seem really cool, but yeah, Half-Life 2 is what draws me in right now. Maybe it's because it's autumn. Autumn is is, is, is coming, it's, it's, it's right here, it's settling in, and Half-Life 2 is such an autumn game, isn't it? Especially that part. Uh, you know, after the the car thing, this, this part on, on the bridge with the helicopter and then you go down to the beach and then all the way up until you arrive to Novo Prospect, you know, this cold, dull beach of Eastern Europe, everything is, is grey and brown, the weather, the sea, the, the sun, it really feels like autumn, doesn't it? There's a the thing, there's something about Half-Life 2 that really feels like autumn. To me. Am I rumbling senseless drivel again, or do you see what I mean? Also, talking about autumn, I've just invented a new drink that is, in my opinion, perfect for autumn. I call it the Irish Affogato. It's like an Irish coffee, except that I replaced the cream by two scoops of vanilla ice cream. And uh, yeah, it's pretty perfect. I added, uh, you know, a dash of caramel sauce to make it a 10 out of 10. And uh, Irish Affogato, in my opinion, drink of the fall. Well, that was vlog 22, back to the basics, just me, my camera, and some random thoughts. I hope you appreciated it. Thanks for watching, see ya really soon, peace.